Every year, more than half of the fire incidents the Singapore Civil Defence Force responds to are in residential premises, and some of these fires have resulted in deaths. Most fires can be avoided with a proper fire safety knowledge. Hi, my name is Donovan. This is your typical peaceful scene in a normal household. But most homes are far from safe because unaware to residents, hidden dangers lurk in the form of fire hazards. Everything looks fine in this homely setting. But let's take a closer look at their kitchen while I have my coffee. Well, did you manage to spot them? Let's see it once again. One of the biggest culprits of kitchen fires is unattended cooking. When oil in a frying pan is overheated, it can catch fire and spread to the cooker hood and kitchen cabinet. Never ever try to use water to put out oil fires. This is dangerous and can intensify the flames. Here is what you should do. First, turn off the gas supply. Next, use the port cover or a fire blanket to cover the port and cut off the air supply. It is important to keep a dry powder fire extinguisher at home in case of fire emergencies. Resist the temptation to throw lighted cigarette butts or burning embers down the rubbish chute. This can result in starting a fire in the rubbish chute bin. The smoke from the fire can enter homes and cause discomfort to residents. Make sure cigarette butts or burning embers are completely extinguished before disposal. When using LPG for cooking, ensure that faulty and poorly maintained equipment are not used. Here are some tips for safe usage of liquefied petroleum gas, LPG for short, as a fuel for cooking. Number one. The regulator should be changed every five years as recommended by the manufacturer. Number two, examine the rubber hose regularly and replace every two years or when worn out. Number three, ensure that your LPG cylinders and accessories have the safety mark on them. Visit www.spring.gov.sg stroke safety for information on the LPG equipment that requires registration and the list of registered suppliers. Number four, check all connections, such as the cooker control knob and regulator to the LPG cylinder, regularly for leakage using soap solution. If bubbles form, call the dealer. Number five, dealers are required to conduct safety checks on your LPG system annually. Contact your dealer if you do not find a completed LPG safety check tag on your cylinder or if the last check was done more than a year ago. Also, never place the cylinder horizontally or upside down. Finally, do not tamper with or modify LPG cylinders. A lady was severely burned when she inserted matchsticks in the cylinder's outlet valve to draw more gas. Homeowners believe that fires start only in the kitchen. But that is not true. It can just as easily start in the living room. Can you spot any possible causes of fire? It could very well be the same in your home. First prize, seven, one, one, three. Yeah! It may be tempting to overload PowerPoints 
or continuing to use faulty electrical appliances or wiring. But remember, a short circuit is all you need to start a fire. Carelessly leaving matchsticks or flammable materials near an open fire is dangerous. A light gust of wind is all that's needed to start the fire. Irons should never be left unattended when in use. Always ensure they are switched off even if you're leaving for just a moment. The room many of us consider the safest is not without its dangers. The bedroom. Surely, there can't be any possible causes of fire in this cosy bedroom, or are there? Children are very curious and like to play with new objects. Combustible objects like sparklers, birthday candles, matches and lighters should not be left within reach of children. It may be too much of a temptation for them to play with these items when no one is looking. Children do many things at one time. Watch TV, play with computer games, listen to music, and play the organ. Make sure that there is enough ventilation so electrical equipment will not overheat. Are you aware of potential fire hazards just outside your house? What are some things to take note of to ensure smooth evacuation in the event of a fire? Combustibles placed along common areas can be targeted by vandals out to create mischief by fire. Any fire along common areas like corridors can hinder the smooth evacuation of occupants and jeopardize their safety. Keep corridors, lift lobbies, void decks and stairwells clear of combustibles. There should be minimum clear escape passage of 1.2 meter at all times. Never vandalize or tamper with firefighting equipment. Fire hazards like damaged firefighting equipment, missing riser locks, or obstructed walkways should be reported to your town council. These are a few examples of potential hazards in Singapore. So, have a look around, identify fire hazards, and take adequate steps to remove them. The following are actual fire scenes that happen to residences in Singapore. If there is a fire outbreak, what are the steps that you and your family should take? Do you have a fire emergency plan? That was a possible cause of fire at home. Don't be caught unaware. Remember, smoke inhalation alone can lead to death. One way to detect fire early is to install a smoke detector. Remain calm. In the event of a fire, the first thing to do is to raise the alarm. Keep low if you have to escape through smoke. In a fire, smoke will naturally rise, leaving some fresh air 30 to 60 centimeter off the floor. Evacuate everyone and close the door to the room which is on fire. This will help con- If you have gas lines, 
the next thing to do is turn off the gas. It is very important to keep a fire extinguisher on hand at home. The fire extinguisher is not complicated to use if you use the four easy steps known as PASS. Out the safety pin or catch. Aim the nozzle at the base of the fire. Squeeze the top lever of the fire extinguisher. Sweep from side to side. And repeat if necessary. Remember, fight the fire if you can, but only do so without endangering yourself or others. And of course, call the civil department at 995. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm the one. I'm the one. Uh, yeah. Is the fire still uh, on? Yeah. Already pull out. Already pull out. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Over there, over there. Fire over there. Come, come. Come, maybe come here. Come. Your quick judgments and actions will save your family and property. Make your home safe today.